designed by the Catholic Relief Services in the Philippines in partnership with the USDA and the Jollibee Foundation, the clustering approach to agro-enterprise development of farmers is a practical eight-step sequential process with corresponding business organizing activities and agribusiness planning tools that bands small farmers into clusters to prepare them to successfully engage in modern markets. Through the capacity building efforts of non-government organizations and other developmental providers, the clustering approach diverts farmers from taking the traditional farm production and product supply strategy towards the more market-driven approach, emphasizing market value and income-generating opportunities. We take the first step inside a small farming community. Step 1 Step 1 facilitates the identification of appropriate sites and all other factors that enable the implementation of an agro-enterprise project. Crucial in this step is the creation of a site working group that will coordinate closely with the local government unit and organizing partner NGO in the area, including other institutions who can contribute to the development and successful implementation of an agro-enterprise project. The second step. This step aims at providing realistic, timely, comprehensive, and reliable information about the producers, their supply, and the market environment from which plans and decisions are based. The third step. This step is undertaken to obtain in-depth market-related information on the chosen product. The fourth step. This step focuses on organizing farmers into clusters to facilitate partnership building with local development organizers and entities for agro-enterprise project sustainability. Step 5. This step requires farmer members to prepare a business plan before making that big leap in the conduct of their first product supply to identified buyers. Step 6. This step is focused on planning and organizing product supply to ensure reliability both in quality and quantity. Step 7. This step provides venue for the cluster to implement its agro-enterprise plan starting with test marketing undertaken that prepares them for bigger market scale activities. The final step. This step prods small farmers to decide whether or not to continue with their agro-enterprise engagement. And if they do, arrive at a decision to do scaling up after analyzing the results of the test marketing activities. The 
eight-step clustering approach is a journey that hopefully will empower farmers in the participation of agricultural value chain leading towards progressive and sustainable livelihoods.